hey there folks and uh, welcome back I guess many moons ago we we sausage uh, 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 crickets but we did them entirely we did entirely cricket sausage it ended up tasting like fish food uh, so cricket sausage zero out of five well that's a terrible start and there they are in all of their, you know, all of their, all of their joy, I guess. Well, first things first, how does it, how does it taste compared to the cricket? Oh, these taste much better. These kind of taste like uh, tortilla chips. Not bad in the slightest. But unlike the cricket sausage, we're going to be mixing this in with pork. These aren't going to go through the grinder. We're going to, we're going to add them to the sausage after it's been ground. One, one or two of them going in the grinder won't hurt anything. Give it, give it the good old shoving it in the hole. It, it, you know, it gets, you, you can see a little bit of it in there. But the reason why I didn't send the rest of them into the uh, grinder is because I want this thing to be extra crunchy. Oh, heck, let's do it all. It's the crunchiest sausage we've ever had. Uh-oh, it's starting to smell like that fish food smell again. Yeah, now we're, now we're making sausage. These little silkworms are pretty salty enough, but we'll, we'll get, we'll help it with just a, a smidge more salt and, uh, you know, a reasonable amount of pepper. I'll stand by you. I'll stand by you. I've got sausage in low place. Says where the whiskey smells in the air. In three, two, one. Let's sausage. Well, that that's it. The party has already come to an end. We'll just link them up. We, we got three different lengths here with another three opportunities to burst. With special thanks to today's Mark Boxalo box artist, this guy. This is a good one because it makes me feel uncomfortable. This Will It Blow is brought to you by Manscaped. Manscaped's Platinum Package 4.0 is here to provide you with grooming and hygiene solutions your daddy could only dream of. With this seven-step process, you'll be lean, clean, and... Bean? Bean looking real good, that is. Starting with step number one, get your smelly, smelly self into the shower and lather up with Manscaped's body wash. Step two, apply your two-in-one shampoo and conditioner. Curveball, step three, grab your lawnmower 4.0 electric and waterproof trimmer and show that shower drain who's boss. Step four, once out of the shower, use the underarm stick deodorant until the flies surrounding you dissipate. Step four. Five. Use the Manscaped ball deodorant because it stinks down there too. Step six. Grab your portable ball toner spray for when you need your balls to smell better on the go. And step seven. Shove the Weed Whacker nose and ear trimmer in its respective destinations. Now that's sophistication. Go to Manscaped.com today and get 20% off plus free international shipping plus two free gifts when you use promo code SAUSAGE20 at checkout. So will it blow? It, oh, it, it, it kind of blew. It kind of blew right there and right there. So a little bit. I'm going to have to give that while it blow. One Mark Ruffalo's. Well, all right then. Here we go. It's a happy face. All right, I'm thinking that these things are are, are pretty cooked by now. Uh, let's open up this one and see how we did. Well, it, it looks like it's jam-packed full of silkworms. Here we go! It's pretty bad. It absolutely still tastes 
you know, like fish food, but now you got all that pork you got to deal with. You give this to someone and they don't know what it is, they know there's something off about this sausage. Heck, they might even tell you that the sausage is spoiled. We did get crispy skin. We did get, you know, a, a solid filling in there. So that's something. But taste-wise, it's a complete goose egg. Uh, so I'm going to have to give this sausage here a 1 out of 5. Bop, 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 bop. That's right. Every bite has like 12 silkworms in it.